For more on the game coming up in a few minutes in sports, but for now we want to kick it out live to Jack Doles in Detroit with some of the sights and sounds of Tigers playoff baseball. Jack. Jason, Tiger fans didn't have to wait as long between postseason appearances this time, but they were every bit as fired up with what the Lions are doing at 4-0 and and what the Tigers have done this uh, summer. This is just something special going on right now in Detroit. Go Tigers, baby! Go Tigers. Seems like 2006 to me! Split New York and sweep them in the deep down! It's the type of thing that can bond a city together. In this case, an entire state. <laughs> Tiger fans were decked out in Tiger gear, and they came from all over. Grillmaster Tony Rogers brought his Weber from Grand Rapids, but he forgot his tools. They're a little burnt, but you know, <laughs> you got to sacrifice something Grill for the greater good. good. I mean, these guys, these guys are expecting right things. Kerry Prentice and his friends were able to score tickets to Game Three, never figuring the rain in New York that interrupted the series would work in their favor. When we had the rain out Friday night, I thought it was bad news. And then we found out that they were going to pitch tonight. And uh, it's a lot better seat when you're in the stadium than being at B-Dubs there on Alpine. So I'm, I'm blessed. Then there's Denny Baxter, one of the Whitecaps' managing partners, who brought a couple of championship rings to the ballpark for good luck. You especially have to take some great pride in seeing this team do well. Oh, absolutely. We've got such a great connection with so many of the ball players from the Whitecaps that have been such big contributors to this championship that uh, it's really uh, pleasing for Lou and I and all of Grand Rapids really should be proud. And Tiger fans aren't the only ones basking in Detroit's winning glow. With the Tigers in the playoffs and the Lions roaring off to a 4-0 start, Detroit News columnist Lynn Henning says these are unprecedented times for sports fans in Michigan. Everything, because it does buoy spirits, and it is something that people can feel good about, and they haven't had that much. Justin Verlander, a big reason the Tigers are in the position they're in, but the Yankees have just scored two runs on the seventh inning, and this game now tied 4-4. Tigers coming to bat in the seventh. Live in Detroit, Jack Doles, 24-hour news edge.